arrive at the border post so after 40 kilometers in the way, we are entering Bulgaria. And the weather forecast announces the coming of winter. Yet we want to reach the Black Sea. We only have to cross the Bulgaria mountains. Well, more than that, it means cold, raining climbs. At 5 p.m. it's dark. So it's a race to set up camp and get washed. Sometimes we have to eat inside the tent. We have to be careful when we play. Wow, we see the Black Sea. We are so happy. We made it. Right away, we go swimming. And there on the beach, we decide we will swim every day. Just for the challenge. But the water is really, really cold. Sometimes there are huge waves, especially because the Black Sea has big storms during winter. Even the roar of the waves make it sound like the sea is howling. And when the north wind blows, it takes a lot of courage to get wet. Curl up like a bull and wait for the wave. When they come, I get wet up to my neck. And then sometimes the sea is all calm and crystal clear. It's when we can see some jellyfish. But we never saw the beluga sturgeon, the ones that make the caviar. Once in the middle of the night, we went to look at the stars. I discovered stars in the sand. It was something that made a green light. It looked like magic powder, like pixie dust. We stayed in a little village of Biala because we followed the season and needed a break. So mom and dad took time to create our new talk. With our help, we do project, dance, theater, painting with Japanese ink, and chemical experiments with natural product. As the sun was rising and the sky was red, the dolphins came to see us. We were alone with them as if they wanted to give us joy.